I think she had intentions on coming over here and stealing my baby and all of us dying and her raising him as her own. Tonight, we continue to follow that strange case of an Indianapolis woman accused of plotting to steal a woman's child and setting fire to her home. We followed this story since it first broke this morning, and tonight we have brand new reaction from the baby's grandmother. RTV6 reporter Chance Walzer joining us live on the northwest side right now with that side of the story. Chance. Well, when Luann Harden agreed to speak to us tonight, she was still trying to wrap her mind around why someone would want to abduct her grandson. Not only that, but spin a pretty bizarre lie to do it. I was really concerned. I was like frustrated. I was aggravated, and I was really upset. It's been a rough 24 hours for Luann Harden. Thursday, a judge sentenced her son, William Alves, for shooting his girlfriend outside Arsenal Tech High School last summer. Then, today, she heard about a woman's alleged bizarre plan to steal Alvy's child, her grandson. I think it was the whole setup, if you ask me. The baby's mother, Juanita Gibson, says she woke up this morning to find multiple fires in her apartment, including one under her son, William's bassinet. Her friend and roommate, Desiree Kent, was gone. So was little William. Police tracked them both down a short time later. That's an awful feeling, waking up to your baby not here and a person you thought was your friend steal your baby out of your possession after you done did all of this for her. According to Gibson, her and Kent became friends at the mall a few months ago. That's when Kent said she was pregnant and needed a place to stay. But when police apprehended her today, they apparently discovered she was not pregnant, but was using a fake belly to spin her story. After my son gets sent, I'll say, you want to go over here and do something. So that's just, that was evil. That was just evil. Kent is in jail tonight. Police are not saying anything right now about a possible motive or the timing between Alvy's uh, sentencing and his son's abduction. Luann says Desiree Kent is a stranger to both her and her son. Live outside the Marion County Jail, Chance Walser, RTV6.